Hello Earthlings and welcome to Vaults. I'm going to be doing a playthrough of it and so get started quickly. I've made myself a lovely concrete bunker. Oh yes, it looks absolutely fantastic, doesn't it? Yeah, I'm Korean Kraken um, and welcome to the IGA. Um, Vaults is basically a it's supposed to be a more realistic and supposedly simplified version of TechIt. I don't believe that. I believe it's really very not simplified at all. It's actually very complicated and there are loads of things that you've got to do if you want to do anything. So, let's begin. Um, the first thing you've got to do apparently is you've got to make a generator, a coal generator. And to make that, you've got to have... Oh god, this is complicated. Why is why is stuff like this always so complicated? Actually, yeah. I remember when I first looked at TechIt, I thought this is the most complicated thing I will ever do in my life, especially all the nuclear fusion and stuff. But this is supposed to be I, I, I don't know, I am not sure. Anyway, so you've got to make a coal generator, which I presume gives you electricity, and if it doesn't, I'll be confused. So for that, you need two furnaces, um, a motor, a bronze copper sorry, cable, iron plates, and some, I think that's copper blocks. It's bronze, bronze blocks. Right, okay, so I think I should have that in some of these chests. Because I decided... I decided I can't be bothered to go mining. Because... Mining just strikes me as very boring, and... If you think about it, you need all this stuff, really, to get going. So I can't be bothered to. Anyway, so, we need a, some bronze ingots. Um, we need some... Oh yeah, just to give you an idea, you can get radar stations. Um, launch a support frame. Hell, I have no idea what I'm going to be able to do, what I'm going to be doing. Uh, rocket. It's just, I just want to see... Rocket launcher, I want one of those. Okay, I think our aim in this series is going to be to get a rocket launcher facility. Just out of interest, what do you need to make one of these? My bad. Okay, yeah, this is me failing now. <laughs> okay, so to make one of these you need steel ingots, a button, a radar gun, and a cruise launcher. Launcher platform. Oh my god. More launcher platforms. More launcher platforms. Oh my god, this is complicated. Oh well, okay, anyway. So, first we need a coal furnace, apparently. So, we've got our bronze box. We need... So I'll get some cobblestone to make furnaces. We need a motor. And for the motor, you need four steel ingots. So we need some steel ingots. Um, we need some cables. I'll deal with that in a minute. I think we need copper for those. Oh yeah, the other thing I found was that I found an unnamed ingot. How can you have an ingot that's unnamed? That's ridiculous. Um, yes, we'll need some wires. And you apparently need a circuit. I think. Yeah, so for a circuit you need small steel, some redstone, and more cables. So, redstone, let's go. I think it's in this chest, the redstone. Yeah, here we go, redstone. And we need some cobblestone. Just to make my... Oh, no. There we go. So. Okay, let's go. Let's get crafting. So, I think the first thing we'll do is to make this 
Oh, hang on. Let's make some steel plates. Because I think they should be quite simple. How do you make a steel plate? I don't know. How can I not know how to make a steel plate? That's the most obvious thing in the game, I expect. It's just four steel ingots. That's the easiest thing ever. So let's see, how many of those do I need? I just need one... I just need three at first. Right. Okay. So, we have three steel plates. Good, at the start. We need two furnaces. Two furnaces. That's good. Um, and we need some copper cables. How do you make copper cables? Um, okay, so for copper cables you need wool. Okay, that's good. <laughs> wool. Right. So this episode is probably going to be me striving to find wool. I have no iron, I just realised. No, I do, sorry. Wool. Put that in the wrong place. So you got shears. Mmm, lovely shears. Okay, so currently it is night, which is a bit annoying. And there are skeletons outside. So I'm going to wait for a day. So, yeah, be back in a minute. Okay, um, yeah, it's now daytime. Day four. I have been doing this for a while, and I can hear skeletons dying outside. So, to the Batmobile. Not really. Need a saw. That's a Paxel, I like those. They're really quite good fun. They are an axe, a spade, and a pickaxe all rolled into one. They're really very useful. Alright, once more onto the breach. I failed at going through a door. Right, okay, we're out. So, hang on. I'm just going to use Ray's minimap here. Which I like, just for the record. Waypoints. And make it green. No blue. What are you talking about? No blue. Yeah. So, this is Ho. I'll turn that off. Exit menu. Ooh, a slime. That's nice to know that's there. I'm not going to kill that right now, because I don't need to. And I can't be bothered to anyway. Ooh, egg. Yummy. Chickens, 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 chickens. I should probably kill one of these while I'm here. In fact, I think I will. Should I kill one? Yeah. I'm just getting a bit of a lag there. Die! I missed. Ooh. What do you want? 
Yay, it's dead. Die. Fun, fun, fun. Anyway, okay, continuing our quest for sheep. Um, let's go over here. Ooh, another slime. It's nice to know that slimes spawn in this area. It's quite good. That's a big slime, though. Ah, what? How did that happen? I believe it's chasing me. I've got got its noise in my headsets, and it's beginning to scare me. Actually, oh well, I will flee it onto these plains. <laughs> yeah, this is probably quite boring for you. So, cows. I think you can do it with leather as well, actually. I will kill them in my bow. Yeah, what a kill. Yeah, you keep moving. Um, can you make them with leather? Yum, 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 yum. Is that a sheep over there? Right now I wish I had opt to find, but... No matter. I will go... And check it out the old-fashioned way. It is... Oh, there are loads of them. Oh, it's great living right next to a plane. Get sheared. Oh, no, I'm hitting it. Yum, yum, yum. Well. Okay, so let's just get this one and we'll see how much we've got. Hello? No, I want your wool. No, come back. Yeah. Got its wool. Yeah, I have three wool currently. Okay. I can go shear some more sheep. Okay, so I've just been sheared some more sheep, and now we can just go back to the bunker. I think I've got something like nine wool now. Yeah, nine wool. There we go. So I've got nine wool, and now we need to go back to the bunker, and I can't remember where it is. So I will do what I did. I will do what I set up earlier. And I enable that waypoint. And I discover that home's over there. 108 meters over there. It's not that far. I just couldn't see it on the mini map. I think I might have to disable some of these mods before next time. But no matter. And how much that much will actually give to you? Bet it's not actually that much. I wonder how many wires. Hmm. Well, we'll soon find out. And here it is. It's actually really small, my bunker. I'm also probably going to do a bit of renovation on the bunker because it's not actually that pretty, I've decided. Eh, yeah, what the hell? don't know if you can hear this, but I'm getting some really weird music in my headset. Alright, here we go. Okay, so, let's make some lovely... That's not the right thing, is it? 
do I want that back? Copper. We need some lovely copper cables. Why is that not working? Yeah, look, you put Browning is cop copper and you surround it by wool. Oh, God. Insulated copper wire. Oh, apparently you have to go down. That's good to know, isn't it? Oh, God, that is so... Yeah, um... So will it work now? Yes, it will. You have to go down. I have never known that before. Uh, normally it's been... Okay, so... Normally it's been, you can just go whatever way you want. Okay, so now we can make our now we can make our uh, circuit. Yes. So we we'll put we put one steel plate in the middle. We get redstone, and we put four redstone around the sides, and then we get four of our insulated copper wire. and we get a basic circuit great so now we go now we use all that to help us to make oh no we need a motor don't we damn it and for that I need four more Ugh. so I need three more God, how fantastic is that god ok so I need some more Actually, no, I don't. I guess that just gives copper wire. And if I put that there, and that there, is that a more efficient way? Someone tell me in the comments, is that a more efficient way of making it? Just make it. Yeah, tell me in the comments, is that a more efficient way? I oh, know it's not because it just gives you individual ones. Or it might be. No, it's, the same. it's exactly the same. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Whatever. Whatever. I don't need to. It doesn't matter. So it's exactly the same. Okay, so to make our motor, we put our, our circuit here. Get our insulated copper wire and we put it in the corners. I actually do have exactly enough. And if I want to, I can use a lever to make some more. And then we surround that in steel. And that gives you a... No, it doesn't. Oh, what have I done wrong? Oh, God. Apparently, on the website I'm looking at, the website I'm looking at is completely different from that of the... of what it actually is. Motor. Let's see. Oh, stop. Yeah, look, you get your insulated copper wire. Oh, so it's just an iron ingot in the middle. I didn't need to make a basic circuit. Oh, well, now we have a <laughs> basic circuit. So, iron ingot in the middle. Then we put steel around it like that. God, I really am failing here. And then we get our wire and we do that. And we get our motor. Yay! Now, I really do sincerely hope that this is correct. That this coal generator is correct. Okay, so we get our... we get two steel plates. Like that. I think this is right. I haven't checked this. 
Then we put an insulated copper wire there. Then we put our two furnaces there and there. We put the motor here. And then we put this across the bottom. Guess what hasn't worked? <laughs> what a surprise! No, you put bronze across the bottom. That is bronze. Oh my god. What have I done wrong? Coal gen. So for a coal generator, in fact, you just have to put steel around a furnace and a motor. Okay, that's nowhere near as complicated as I thought. Right, so most and <sighs> God. Yay! So we've now got a coal generator. Fantastic! A coal generator. Let's put it down. Yay! That's amazing. Look at that. So I assume you put coal in there. Yay. So we now have a coal generator and it's dark again. Uh, yeah, I think I'll leave it there for today, guys. Next time I will be attempting to make a battery box and an infuser. And then if I have time, I will make an enrichment chamber in order, all in our process, to make nuclear fission slash missile silos. I really want to try out some of the missiles, actually, because you've got antimatter ones, nuclear ones, they just sounds amazing. Anyway, uh, don't forget to like, favourite, subscribe. The website is theiga.moonfruit.com. Twitter, official IGA. Uh, Facebook, the IGA. Uh, yeah, it will be in the description, as usual. Thanks for watching, and bye.